You want me to lie? How do you lie? I don't want you to lie. I just want you to tell the truth. That's why I told you the truth. You don't like the truth. Why don't you tell me what happened to you during the past three or four months of your time in Afghanistan? This was the Canadian agents participating in a joint venture to exploit this uh, young man as a source of intelligence with the U.S. government. So a firefight started. Did you, did you guys make a decision that uh, that you were going to fight until the end? They made a decision. They made a decision? At the time, he hadn't been charged with anything, much less tried. It was obvious to everyone who looked at the situation, including the United Nations and by then some American courts, that this was unlawful. I mean, you've got to take ownership of what happened, take responsibility, and move on. If he did do it, you can't hold a 15-year-old responsible for doing that. Um, in those situ and that's under those circumstances, I would have done it. His treatment was worse than anybody else's. He said to himself, yeah, I can't move my arms. I requested medical for a long time. He doesn't do anything about it. No, I mean, they, they look like they're healing well to me. You know, no, I'm not I, a doctor, but I think you're getting good medical care. No, I'm not. You're not here. He was not a hardened terrorist. He wasn't. Well, 